think those are meant to represent reaching for the sun or maybe playing basketball? One of the two. Our OCG-sponsored sun substitute is the closest we get to actual sunlight in Propast. Building the new Europe, because that went well. He looks really familiar. Home, sweet, uh, well, no, just home. Hey, you lost. I'm a rootin', tootin', six barrel shootin', mad totin' crow cowboy. Yeehaw! My favorite Avant Cafe and Meta Brewery. It's a chain, yeah, but local to the Prague district and so much better than those Scandinavian omni chains. Move along. Nothing to see here. There are so many dream junkies around. The city should do something. It's unseemly. What they should do is ban dream machines. Seriously? Because some people can't moderate their dream time? Because it can't be healthy. Just look around. The best food in Propaz comes from the street vendors and their food carts. Hands down, no contest. Queenie's Quintessentials. Hey, That's Queenie's name? shop, obviously. Come again, anytime. I don't know. I'm not really into the whole Rebear Couture thing. Abandon all hope, ye who enter here. Cheery stuff. Those ad bots are all over the place. Sometimes I think they target me specifically just to fuck with me. They're really pushing the new Bingo Dreamer fizzy drink. Anything Dream Machine related is a big seller these days. Freeze-dried jellyfish chips, vacuum-packed boiled beet, carbonated tequila shots, blood pudding fudge, fried cabbage jerky, oh, salted pigeon bits. Bits? Oh, which bits? Billions of people use the Dream Machine. I find that hard to comprehend. One in five people access Dream Time at least once a week. Madness. The tallest office building in Propast, home to Dr. Roman Zelenka's psychotherapy praxis and a thousand other businesses. Nayla has a nickname for her mobile kitchen, and that nickname is Carl, because Marxist. Did you see that? I shouldn't get involved. I have enough on my plate and I'm running late and I'm already neck deep in the Uminska campaign. I don't need more political drama. I don't really need any political drama. I can't believe the eye is harassing Nella. She sells food. It's not like she's doing anything illegal. Is she? I mean, I know she's politically involved, but there's no law against being Marxist. What was all that about? Fucking I. Making up shit so that they can harass anyone who doesn't toe the line. Now I'm going to waste the whole afternoon standing in line at the district office for a permit I don't fucking need. <sighs> Never mind that this is just a tip of the garbage heap. They're restricting transit between sectors, adding more security to all the metro stations and ports, requiring paperwork for anything beyond local lines. I mean, what the fuck? I knew Parliament was tight with the Syndicate, but this is Chungo, man. 
They're planning something. Probably going to hunt down and the rest revolutionaries next. That's me fucked then. I'm sure Word you... Word is they rounded up all the European liberty folks in the Berlin district last week. Detained them on suspicion of terrorism. Terrorism! For speaking their minds. And okay, for releasing clouds of biography. I know that clique, they're harmless. It was just a call to action. That's fucking terrorism now. Scary. Scary. That's exactly what it is. And your candidate isn't going to change anything for the better. Maybe not. But Uminska won't change anything for the worse, either. Unlike Konstantin Wolf. Kaiser Konstantin. Puta! If that schwein gets elected, I'm moving to Paris. They'd never let you in. One of the conglomerate city-states of North America, then. Newport. The fucking Republic of Los Angeles. Hell, even Bostonia. Anywhere but Kaiser's Europe. That's why Leia Uminska is the best choice. No one's gonna put the Marxists in office, Nela. At least my candidate has a fighting chance. And she is a socialist. She's a moderate, Zoe. A moderate! What's the point in that? Moderation is just another word for compromise. Anyway, what are you having? Having? Lunch, Zozo. For your turbo. Listen, I have a new supplier for Porkwurst. The collective down on Caprova. Organic meat, the real deal. None of that vat-grown slop. Don't know how they do it. Connections on high, plenty of mouses swapping hands. But they're legal, I think. The pork sausages sound totally delicious. I'm not sure Reza will agree, but he needs to be more adventurous when it comes to his diet. The pork sausages sound delicious, but Reza plays it safe when it comes to food. Europolitan through and through. No tolerance for organic meats. I'm working on it, but baby steps. I'm gonna have to go with the cheese soup, again. Dobra, coming up. You should join the protest this afternoon. We're marching on the sector office. I think it would take a lot more than a political rally for Mira to give me time off. I'm gonna have to pass. Smart girl. We'll probably get beaten by the bulla and tossed in the zona. Just another fucking Monday in Propast. Here you go. Thanks, Nella. If you reconsider, we'll head out around noon. Time to let those cunts know we're watching the Watchmen. Map! Get your map here! Map! Safe. Dependable. Store it. Dieter Gross says the experience in Gravitas is yet to be. Singing right song. The Collapse, August 8th, 2209. The day everything went to hell. I remember only fragments. It was a scary day. The Uminska ads are bold and she does come across as a leader. That's why I'm volunteering you know, for her, I guess. That and also Baruti's passion. I think I'm voting manifesto this election. That's the hand that feeds logo. It's conveniently pointing the way to the entrance. Riots, demonstrations, it's all over the news. Europolis is really on the edge of something and Propast gets the worst of it. Reza has a great friend and an amazing editor in Sully, and I wouldn't have lasted a month without his shoulders to cry on. Sully's the best. Mm, smells good. You didn't have to bring me lunch, Zoe. Good, because I didn't. This is for Reza. And yet you come see me first. This tells me something. 
You're enormous. You have your own gravity field. There's no escaping it. Talk to you after I've delivered this to my man? I'd be offended if you didn't. The boyfriend. Working hard to save the world, one story at a time. What's up? Toppling governments and exposing corporate conspiracies? Well, all in a daze. How was... you know... Therapy? It's therapeutic, I guess. You guess. I know he means well, but... not in the mood for more psychotherapy. I wish he'd leave the psychotherapy for later, but... I know he means well. Dr. Roman oh. is really good, I just... I don't know if it's helping. I don't remember anything. But it's getting easier. Easier? Sure. And sooner or later, I will remember some things. Everything. So, working. On what now? A couple of things. The clampdown, mostly. There's tons of buzz about the Syndicate shutting down parts of the Metro. Uh, escalating identity checks, raiding news feeds. We're expecting the worst. You're loving it. I wouldn't say that, but... It's exciting. We can make a difference. I pray they try to raid a hand. Sully's already preparing the lawsuits. We'll sue them for emotional trauma, unlawful intrusion, damages to property, interference with the free press. We'll sue them for 300 million yuan. He's looking forward to it. I am looking forward to it. Bring it on. On your way to the shop? Ready to get rid of me already? I bring lunch. Cheese soup, mm. the usual. I forgive you. You can stay as long as you don't talk to me. I need to finish this story. The clampdown? No. That new Bingo Dreamer soft drink. Apparently they fast-tracked EFSA approval and skipped a few steps. Some customers have reported seeing the Bingo Dingo after drinking a can. We'll probably get it pulled from vending machines. That's my boyfriend, getting fizzy drinks yanked from store shelves. I'm a modern-day Gilgamesh, saving the world from hallucinogenic sugar water. Thanks for lunch. I appreciate it. I guess I'm making dinner. You guessed correctly, ZML. Oh, I won't be home until later. I'm volunteering. Any special requests? Nothing heavy. Have the membranes been repaired? I queried the building net, but no reply. Prepare for the worst. I can't believe we don't live in a climate controlled apartment. As soon as I get a raise, we're moving. I don't want to leave Propast. No, I like the neighborhood. But a more modern building would be nice. No more sunny living at Sonnenschein Plaza by original consumer goods. Anyway, lunch. Here, I have to run. Have fun at the shop. Say hi to, uh, to Crazy Face? Mira. Come on, she's not... Well, yeah, she is. Mira is Crazy Face. There's no way around that. Hey, my favorite manic pixie dream girl. Sully loves to test me. He knows what buttons to push. I'm calling his bluff. Sully is the sweetest. I know he likes me, but he tries so hard to keep it light and friendly. I love him. Sully loves... Is that all you see? A walking cliche? That hurts, man. I see a potentially very scary person. I'm a scary manic pixie dream girl. What can I say? You transcend cliches. Yeah, fuck you too. You look awful, by the way. What happened? A wedding. Finally. Who's the lucky girl? You know I only have eyes for you. Dump that deadbeat boyfriend of yours and let's catch the first train to Copenhagen. I'm trying to slowly poison him with my home cooking. I'll give it a few months. How was the wedding? Awful. I feel like shit. It was a Polish wedding. A Polish wedding with an unlimited supply of Polish vodka. Oh, that does sound awful. I take it you haven't been to a Polish wedding. It was fantastic. It was a disaster. It was all things good and bad. And once the bride and groom stopped screaming at each other, it was incredibly romantic. I'm man enough to admit that I wept. Openly. I was Trieste. Really good. I mean, it's Trieste. It's not the Gold Coast. But it was nice to get out of the city. Did you know there's an actual sun up there? 
Ah, urban myth. The sun is a lie. I don't believe it for a second. Besides, my skin would probably turn to ashes if it's exposed to UV rays. You're a child of Propas, Sully. Constantinople. But close enough. I don't expect an islander to understand European geography. Born in India, spent half my life in Africa, but hey, who's keeping track? Talk like an islander, live behind islander walls, deal with islander shame. That's what I say. I'd love to chat more with Sully. Everyone's talking about the clampdowns today. If anyone knows what's going on, it's Sully. He prides himself on staying on top of the news cycle. What's going on with these eye clampdowns everyone's on about? Jesus wept those betten heads. It's insidious is what it is. A little bit here, a little bit there, and soon Propast is a bucking gulag. But why are they doing it? Who knows? It's the Syndicate. They don't need something as banal as reasons. They want people off the streets and hooked up to their dream machines. You think that has something to do with it? Yes, no, maybe. Mouser rules, and those dream machines are a license to print it. It would be naive to think they're completely unconnected. Watikov holds a lot of sway over the Syndicate. But we're going to find out for sure. Your boy toy there, once he's looked into the Phantom Bingo Dingo, will be taking point. This story is going to make a lot of people very angry. And that will make Sully very, very happy. Won't they just shut you down? <laughs> Let them try. We have the future on our side. And once I win my Pulitzer, I'll whisk you away to a better life. <laughs> Copenhagen, right? That's just for the marriage license. We'll go to Overview Q in Dacia and live like savages on the beach. <laughs> Sounds good. I'll get back to you once I've taken care of you know who. I heard that. Which part? All the parts. Meh. You'll still eat my food, even if it is poisoned. Food is food. I've distracted you two enough. When are you coming by for dinner, Sally? When is your man cooking dinner next? Cruel but fair. We'll have you over soon. Maybe we'll even find you a dinner date. Next to you, no woman measures up, but beggars, choosers, take care, Zoe. Stop by any time. Thank you. 